I think we need to make the most of the Commonwealth, but in an ideal world, I'd like to see it get tougher on the human rights, democracy, on the golden thread of things that, as I've argued, make countries successful in the long term. I'd like to see a toughness on that, because I think in the end it'll be in all our interests. And sometimes belonging to organization helps you to lift your own standards. As for the Snowden uh, revelations, all, all I would say is this. It is very damaging when you reveal lots of information about organizations that necessarily have to be secret. And the, you're in danger with revelations like Snowden. You're in danger of helping the terrorists, of helping the organized criminals. Because if they find out all the ways in which they are being followed or monitored or what have you, uh, they will take uh, the relevant action. So, so I think it really was a horrific act, a horrific event. And I think it was right for the world to take a very strong stance. I obviously wasn't successful in my own parliament in taking quite the stance I wanted to. But nonetheless, I would argue that the stance that people like me took and the Americans took has led to what's happening now in Syria, where all the signs are they really are removing and destroying their chemical weapons. So I think the chemical weapons agreements and treaties are really worth trying to hold on to as a world in all our interests. And so I think that's my, my answer there.